The towers we are going to need are the Brawler and the Cryo Maxer. Once you have them equipped, we can go to Night 2 Solo Hard Mode. Once loaded in, you are going to want to skip the ready button as fast as possible and wait for the timer to be over just to skip the cutscene as fast as possible too. Then you're gonna put two level 0 brawlers in two spots, these two spots to be exact, and set them to strongest. Then all you have to do now is wait for wave 1 to start. Once all the mobs on wave 1 die, you should get a bit of a cash bonus and then you can place a brawler right here and set it to strongest just like the rest. A little while after that though, you'll get some money from the mobs so you'll need to put one brawler next to this one and set it to strongest. After wave 2 ends, you'll get some more money then you'll put a brawler here and another brawler behind it aligning it with the C section you see on this little turn. Soon after that, you'll get enough money to upgrade this brawler to level 1. And then you'll need to wait a while for all the mobs to die, then you'll get the wave reward and the wave clear bonus, which then you can upgrade those two brawlers to level 2. But that's not the end of it though, because after that, you get money to be able to upgrade this brawler to level 1 then soon after when all the mobs die once again and you get the wave bonus from this wave you'll upgrade it to level 2 and put cryomancer aligning it to the turns right there and putting another cryomancer next to the first cryomancer and upgrade both of them to level 2 as soon as possible this is to avoid the strong mobs from walking out of the brawler's range as without the cryomancer this would not be possible and they would just walk off the brawler's range. I haven't tested this with freezer, it might work, but comment down below if I should test it. Then as soon as wave 5 ends, you're going to remove slash delete the cryomancers and put all of the brawler's target to last enemy. At this point, you're gonna need to restart starting from wave 6. That's the end of the strat because after you die, you just restart and do this over again and you get 100 candies every time from doing it. As you can see here, the round duration, 3 minutes and 30 seconds, which if you add that up, 3 minutes and 30 seconds, 100 candies each time, that is over 1,800 candies per hour. I also recommend you to do this during the weekends for the 1.5 times candy bonus.